minutes. Uh, Mr. Chairman, a point of order. We had those clocks going for the national debt. They are going too slowly. You are proposing to eliminate the XM Bank, which will add billions of dollars to our national debt. And you have been unwilling, unless you change your mind, to join with me in tax increase measures that would replace that revenue. The, uh, now, whenever somebody wants to increase the national debt, they always say, change the accounting system. And that XM Bank would be costing us money if we used fairy tale value accounting. I don't think we should. The fact is, we should use GAAP, not GOP accounting. G A A P, not G O, not G O P accounting. What is the underlying theory of fair value accounting? It is that we look not at the profits and losses of the XM Bank, properly accounting for the risk they take, but we look at how what their costs would be if they weren't the XM Bank, but at a higher cost of funds. That's like saying Pizza Hut is overreporting its income because they report accurately what the cost they pay to the bank for the money they borrow, not the higher amount they would pay if they were Jack's Pizzeria instead. The fact that Pizza Hut has a lower cost of funds doesn't mean they should report higher interest costs and report a loss. But that's what you do under fairy tale value accounting. Also, I'm in on foreign affairs. I sit there while Republicans say that Democrats might support unilateral disarmament, that we would give up our arms and then go into the arms limitation talks asking others to follow our, our, our lead. That's what we're doing here. Germany has an export credit authority that's three times as large. They have total exports three times as large per capita, and they run a trade surplus. And we would go into negotiations with Germany, giving up the XM Bank. Why don't we give up our missile? Time the gentleman is expired. The chair now recognizes the gentleman from New Jersey, Mr. Garrett.